What's up guys, Casey here, and today I'm going to be doing a quick look over of the iRange X multi-protocol transmitter that Banggood is offering right now for pre-order. So at the moment, the price is $79.99 if you got in and pre-ordered at between uh, 0 and 100 uh, sales. You would have gotten it for $75.99, but sadly, I got in at $79.99. Because I was on Bangla's website and I was scrolling and I saw this thing and I was like, is that the TBS Tango? And I was like, no, it's not. <laughs> you know, it's iRange X. And I do have the iRange X module in my 9XD Plus and it's pretty, it's really solid, you know. I use it for my tiny whoops and normally my smaller bills because some of them run Spectrum and FlySky. But, um,. I don't always want to grab my Tyrannus and go fly like a super tiny quad with it. So that's my purpose of getting this radio because it's smaller. Um, it won't take up as much space in my bag. I'll be able to put my battery charger in there and, and actually close my LiPo bag now. Um, it's got the multi-protocols. It's got a USB port so you'll be able to hook it up with simulators. DRL, GTA, all that stuff. This transmitter should be running on the deviation firmware. At least that's what I've seen in the forums that um that I've been reading, the Facebook groups and whatnot. You know, if it's open TX, hey, even better. But um deviation is what has been the word. Uh telemetry. I don't know how you're gonna hear telemetry because from looking at the pictures here, I don't see any headphone port or a like the, the 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 holes for a speaker you know on the on the on the tango the speaker is right here on this uh on this pad on the bottom but i don't see any holes for a speaker you know i mean if they did i wish it was right here you know two speakers boom boom but i don't see anything for that in the pictures you know, I'm just waiting on this radio to get here, and uh, we probably won't get it till like next year, January 15th or 12th or somewhere around there, because Bangor gets their stock in on December 22nd. So we got a good wait ahead of us. The antenna on this radio is built in, so just know that you can't go super far with this thing, and that's not why I'm buying it. I'm buying it because I want to fly micros, and micros, you can only go so far with them anyway. So that's my main purpose because I don't always want to use my Tyrannus, you know. My Tyrannus sits there. It's just waiting for when I go out to the field and I'm flying like a really, I'm flying my um 200 plus size quads. And then I can have this guy to fly my tiny whoops or something. But um, if you're, if you're getting into the hobby and you're looking for something that's not too big, something that's going to be able to support um all the pre-built mod models that that are out there then this radio is something for you now just note this this little this 2.8 lcd screen you will not be able to see your fpv feed through this screen this screen is only for conf um, configuring your settings in the radio your model and telemetry that's it this screen isn't going to show you any video feed Maybe in the future someone's going to modify it and be able to do that. But as of now, it can't. So if you guys are looking into getting this radio, you know, shoot a comment down below. Say why you would get it or why you wouldn't get it. I mean, I know why most people won't get it is because it's, they might say it's a waste of money. And, you know, you could always just, what, put like 20, 30 bucks more on and get yourself a QX7. But for me, I want something that will be able to support all the protocols because I don't only fly FR Sky and you know I do want to get rid of the iRange X module and get a crossfire so that's why I'm getting this radio why are you getting it subscribe like for future content I haven't been flying much because it's super cold outside and I hate being in the cold I have a cold right now if you know if you noticed um, but I'll catch you guys later alright Peace.